I got to make this kind of quick because it is the day before Thanksgiving. There's food prep that needs to happen. Um, musical tip of the day. Musical tip of the day. Learn to see with your ears. Learn to see. Stevie Wonder sees with his ears. I see with my ears. Um, and, and what that means is listen to the greats who I, you know, even great producers. Uh, Trackmaster, um, who's a Chicago producer. Um, they made a song called Poe Pimpin'. Um, very phenomenal. DJ Unique. These are all producers of the past that when I listen to their music, I say, what made them great? Dr. Dre, what, what makes this song great? Who produced it? You know, dive deeper into it. So if you're listening to a great song, pull up the song. A, a lot of times we can look at the back of CDs or, or tapes and it'll give everything. You know, who was the keyboardist? Who was this? Who was? You can do the same thing on, on Google. You know, and Wikipedia will tell you track by track who did what on what song. Um, so when you're listening to music, learn to listen with your ears. Learn to listen with your ears. Your ears are your most important tool. Um, that song that I'm working on right now, where did I draw that inspiration from? I was listening to a song by Matthew Ward, who's a uh, f contemporary Christian artist of the 80s. They, they, one person coined him as the Stevie Wonder of Christian music. Um, I don't think he played the keyboard. He was just a singer. But the, the song what I, that I was listening to was called a song... Uh, the song was called Summer Snow, Summer Snow. And the piano, if you listen to that piano, I said, man, I like to play that because you, you can't find it. So I began to play it and I'm like, it sounds like he's doing this. And it evolved into something. Well, OK, put that on pause for a second. We'll come back to that. A new creation was birthed out of listening with my ears, sing with my ears, basically, you know, picking up all the grace notes picking up uh the sustains picking up the 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 uh sus twos the sus fours the picking up the minor chords um picking up every last nuance of a song and if you can learn that skill learn that skill learn uh, man feel the emotion see the emotion with your ears like wow where did that pain come from why does that person play like that if you can learn how to do that, man, man, I think Corey Henry said your greatest tool is your ears. Your greatest tool actually is your ears in music. That is your greatest tool. And of course, your feet, your hands and, the, the, and everything else that you use to play your instrument. But learn to see with your ears. Peace.